Hi, and welcome to Conversations of Civility at FIT. My name is Ron Milan, and I'm the Chief Diversity Officer at the Fashion Institute of Technology. And today we have as our guest a speaker, an educator, an entrepreneur, a community builder, and an alum, uh, Ms. Cindy Spiegel. I'm so excited to be here. Oh, we're glad to have you here. This is great. Yeah. Welcome. Thank um, you. Let's start off, and what does civility mean to you? Yeah, so I think civility often gets misinterpreted and people think it's about being nice to somebody else. Um, and I think it goes beyond that. Really, civility to me is listening to people who don't think like you and truly listening, not just looking at them, listening and have a con having a conversation and understanding their perspective, even if it is different than your own, and respecting that as so. Well, that leads me to my next question because you're, you're doing a lot of, as we mentioned, community building. Yep. So talk a little bit about what you mean by community of us. Yeah, so in January of 2018, I started what I refer to as a project, but it's really a community, and it's called the Community of Us. And it was in an effort to allow women a platform to have challenging conversations with folks that were different than themselves. What I found in my business and speaking around the country is that there are so many of us from different walks of lives that will never cross paths with other people. And that doesn't make them bad or good, it just is what it is. And I think that we are very quick to judge other people who are different without ever having had a conversation with them. And so the community of us is a place where we get together monthly and it's all done online and we get women from all over. Um, different religions, different uh, races, different belief systems, and it's about having these conversations and being able to really facilitate a challenging conversation and giving you the tools to do that with folks that are different. Not in an effort to change someone's opinion, but in an effort to listen and to be heard. Well, that leads me, um, so you're dealing with a lot of diversity and dialogue. Yeah. So, and, mm -hmm. and that, one of the things that we're doing at the school is talking about how do we deal with different conversations where there's very diverse yeah. opinions and how do we engage people with different opinions? Well, it's a great question, and I think it's, first I'd like to preface this by saying I'm speaking as a human, not as an expert on anything. I'm an expert in my own experience and, and an expert in speaking with lots of types of folks. And I think the first thing we have to do is to be curious. And that sounds really simple, but I think we come to conversations with judgments already. I already know what you're going to say because I've checked you out online and I know everything about you, and because you like this person, I don't like you. And instead, what I ask is that we are curious, and we are open-minded, and we are open-hearted, and we actually look at a person as a human, and as an individual beyond their belief system. And the second we can be, curi be curious about somebody else, we stop judging. And it's a term that I refer to as othering. Right? The second we see somebody as an other, you're no longer human. I don't have to show you compassion or empathy. Um, but when I see you as myself, then I will listen to you, I will hear you, but we have to stop othering people before we can do anything else, and then we are curious and open. There we go. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Thank you. And this is Ron Milan, and this is Conversations Civility at FIT.